This is a demonstration of second shift theorem for Laplace transform. Laplace transform of f of t minus c times e of t minus c is equal to e power minus cs times Laplace transform of ft with a demo using class spec 400. Here is an example. Suppose you want to find the Laplace transform of e power minus 2t times a heavy side unit step function u of t minus 2. In order to find the answer, because of the heavy side unit step function here, we need to apply the second shift theorem, which says that Laplace transform of f of t minus c times the unit step function u of t minus c is equal to e power minus cs, Laplace transform of ft. So, by comparison, we know that c is equal to 2 now. And by comparison, e power minus 2t is equal to f of t minus c. Since we know c is equal to 2 now, so f of t minus 2 is equal to e power minus 2t. Now, change the t to t plus 2. Then, we are going to have our ft. So ft is equal to e power minus 2 times bracket t plus 2. So the answer, according to the second shift theorem, this is equal to e power minus 2s because c is equal to Laplace transform of ft is e power minus 2 times t plus 2. Now, this is equal to Laplace transform of e power minus 2t times e power minus 4. And then you take out e power minus 4. And then you have Laplace transform of e power minus 2t. Which is equal to e power minus 2 times s plus 2 times Laplace transform of e power minus 2t is 1 over s plus 2. Here is a demonstration using casual class pad. I'm going to find the Laplace transform of e power minus 2t times heavy side unit set function u of t minus 2. So what I'm going to do is go to action, select advance, then select Laplace transform. Then input e power negative 2t t which I can use to the keyboard and input a t using alphabet and then move down and multiply with heavy side unit step function which I can use the keyboard again and go to advanced, so math2, then I'm going to use uh, advanced, okay, advanced, have you side unit step function, I'm going to enter alphabet again, t minus 2, okay, then move to the right, Enter a comma, this is a function of t. 
and then comma again I want to take Laplace transform so I'll get a function of s then close the packet and then execute and this is the answer